everybody crying out for democracy. Happy 50th anniversary to Dr. and Mrs. Bicessa. 50 years of wedded bliss. <laughs> to the blight who was in cricket who could blight the greatest team on earth. I just want to ask you, but Sharon don't like cricket too. But I ain't come for that, not tonight. We come for serious thing tonight. Her Excellency Paula May Weeks contemplated, conceptualized, and concocted a throne speech delivered from a bully pulpit to denigrate, to disrespect, and to bring patriotic parliamentarians into odium and disrepute. But she did so from an untenable position of mediocrity, dishonesty, culpability, dishonor, and denial. Paula May came to the office of president on merit and has transformed her excellency into her criminality. Paula, the title Your Excellency was designed by the framers of our Constitution so that only the best of the best, the brightest of the bright, and the most upstanding moral and ethical individuals would even be considered to hold the office of president. Paula, you got there on merit. But then you conspired with a cheater to thwart merit. But for the result of your misbehavior with Keith Christopher Rowley, which is and still is painful to Trinidad and Tobago, the ascendancy of a mediocre candidate to hold the esteemed, critically important office of Commissioner of Police, that people around you, Rowley, Bless C. Passad, and you yourself have not been criminally charged for misbehavior in public office is only because that person benefited from the crime perpetrated on August 11, 2021. The Commissioner of Police has sent no file to the DPP, and the DPP is ignoring the UNC. It is only your nepotistic, questionable, myopic, conflicted appointments to the independent Senate bench that prevented a tribunal to investigate your misbehavior, Paula. While your Bishop's Tea Party, your presiding officer, thwarted debate in the Electoral College to uphold your mediocrity, Paula. Paula May, your excellency is only a title by office. You, Paula, have broken your oath. You have broken the trust, and you have broken the law. So, Paula May, you may not lecture citizens on propriety, integrity, honesty, patriotism, and morality, for you have been found wanting in all of these spheres. So, no, Paula, no, you may not. You thwarted the merit list. Why does one want to thwart merit? Merit is good. Merit is honest. Merit is positive. Merit is effective. Merit is fair. To thwart merit, one has to be bad, dishonest, negative, ineffective, and unfair. Thwarting merit is dangerous. It allows for pathways of underachievement, incompetence, and corruption to rise to the top to suffer the entire nation. Paula, you may not, because more than you are illegal, more than your actions were anti-democratic, more than your actions were unconstitutional, more than your actions were unpatriotic, your actions, Paula, were dangerous and have led to bloodletting across the entirety of Trinidad and Tobago. So no, Paula, you may not. The 594 that I had yesterday when penning this speech now has moved to 604 murder victims since August 11, 2021, when you let Rowley whisper sweet nothings in your ear, Paula. 
These dead people say, no, Paula, you may not lecture the parliamentarians. The seven children raging between the ages of three and 11 who have been shot by bullets say, no, Paula. So, Paula, you may not. The hundreds of women raped, battered, beaten with impunity and no convictions. These women say, no, Paula, you may not. Opening your business in Trinidad and Tobago is a deadly risk as we speak. Arriving home after work and school is a risk. Selling doubles, you can die. Stopping in traffic or at a red light strikes fear into the hearts of citizens, Paula. So no, Paula, take off your purple curtain and don't talk down to us, Paula. Because of your illegal action, Paula, because you thwarted merit, Paula, because you cheated for the PNM, Paula, because you breached your oath of office, Paula, because you were an unpatriotic, politically pliable, dishonest, arrogant disgrace, Paula, the citizens say to you in one voice, Paula, you may not. But some have benefited from your lack of character, Paula. The sum happens to be all the PNM bigwigs. For example, Rowley has not been charged yet for not filling out his Form B of his integrity forms. He has not been charged yet for lying on his integrity form about the value of his Inis Gate property that he ne negotiated from a contractor who gets contracts from the PNM. He's paid $1.2 million and he paid $33,600 stamp duty. That equates to a value of $1.68 million. Rowley in his crapple foot writing on Form A with seven different types of writing put that the value was $1.2 million. That's a lie. He signed that. That's a criminal charge, but no charge at eh, DCP Jacob, the sixth place man who has been elevated because Paula let Rowley whisper in she ears on August 11, 2021. What about Camille, the cash lady? Sign a declaration. False. She took out, as she says, she take out the money from there. Come there, the bank say, na, na, na. What happened with that, Paula? Where the cash come from, Camille? You're talking, you didn't want it to go and buy some more wigs. You come to play, you're looking like Anil with bald head. You could never look good like the Dogla. Foster Cummins going, Cummins and going. Foster Cummins with land. Foster Cummins with Venture Credit Union. Foster Cummins with MTS. Where the charge, Paula? Where the charge? Fake oil investigations. All they needed was funding to pay for an uh, engineer to authorize and identify the audit and the quantum of oil coming out. No money forthcoming, Paula. Why, Paula? Because you let Rowley whisper in your ears and you let Rowley's friend dance bareback using racial epithets towards everybody in this country. And Rowley's friend, Rowley said that's his friend, but the papers don't say Rowley. Is that still your friend, friend when he uses the N-word and the C-word? Nobody asked him that, but a counselor in Grandy who happened to be black and who allowed to use the N-word, she said, all you're making front page, Paula. A man find a Cayman in Aranguez. Protect the people that Cayman could have bite a child. But he end up in a police car. Lock up because hunting season finished February 28, 2022. Okay, the law is the law. But what about Crow Crow who boasts that he had a 70th birthday with two guana and a guti? Where Crow Crow? I want to see the little PNM racist midget in a van sitting down with the handcuff Paula. Where is it? Did Convent Girl, did Convent Girl break the red light when there was an accident by Beatham? coming off the public bus route to come on to the highway and bounce a man going east. Did he break the traffic light? We don't know, Paula. Or where he, isn't it every time you get in an accident, the police tell you, well, even though you've made the statement, there is still the possibility that we could charge you for reckless endangerment and bad driving. What happened with the convent girl, Paula? Faris illegal indemnity with a witness in a criminal matter. DPP. Commissioner of Police, can an attorney general interfere in a criminal case and sign a deal with a criminal, a witness in a criminal probe? Oh, Lord. Well, if it's PNM, you can. 
So Paul, our next strong speech, since you don't have the caliber to resign, Paul, how can we know? You like that little put on the front curtain and come out, you wake up from your slumber, you eat plenty, you go in the plantation house and you tell yourself you're looking good. You decide who you invite to a national awards, have 27 African and 5 Indian and say, yes, great is the PNM. That's not racist, that is equity, that is nationality. You have divided this country with Rowley. So Paul, I know you wouldn't resign because you covet office. You don't covet other things, but you covet office. Your speech... Your speech should take a whopping 11 seconds. Let me write your speech for you for next year, throne speech, when you come with a different color curtain, Paul. Hear your speech. As you, as you chant it from your expansive lungs. Great is the undemocratic PNM. Great is the unpatriotic PNM. Great is the evil PNM. I too am a PNM, and PNM shall prevail. Now your speech and walk out. That's the disgrace that you are, Paula May Weeks. Be proud of your cult, Paula, the PNM cult. Save your hypocrisy for your bishop's tea party at the plantation house, refurbished by your PNM for 118 million while children can't get laptops, people starving, and you cut food cards from differently able. But you looking good in the mirror in the slave house, Paula. Say, whoa, my ancestors, look, I dance the two step to pan over your dead carcasses in this plantation house that Rowley and his corrupt PNM have built for me to gallery myself while I still sleep in Hillcrest down in Pity Valley. To your specifications, your partner in crime, Keith Christopher Rowley, as the UNC joins with the people to say, no, Paula, you may not. But what is wrong with merit? We teach our children to work hard, be di disciplined, show stick to itiveness, passion, creativity, and you will rise. I learned that quite back in 1980, swimming. I was swimming back then, they had no touch pads and no electronic timing like what Kamala built in the aquatic center that Shamba don't even know how to maintain and it turned green and nothing going on there and it's cobweb but Kamala built that you touch the pad boop your electronic time come up fancy greatest facility in the western hemisphere by Kamala Pasad Bissessa back then didn't have that it had three people with stopwatch and them three people well, it's just like the PNM. They will tend to cheat because they're friend and family and nepotism and so on. And I swim a race against my friend, Jape the Kudre, who's now the CEO at one of them big, if you only want a Volvo, check him out, right? But I beat him, and I know how to touch him, because you could see through your peripheral vision. But the timekeepers stop their watch, and they give him the race. I come out with my little Afro bronze I had here then. Rub coconut oil in it. My Indian mother used to do that, Rowley. Remember you tell Glenn Ramadasin, go and put more coconut oil in your head with your racist self, Rowley, in the parliament in 2011. I used, my mother used to put coconut oil in my head. It didn't work to keep it for longevity, but it used to look good with the afro. And I come to my father and I say, Daddy, but <laughs> I cry. I say, but I win. I win. I out touch him and they cheat me, they cheat me. I say, my father go hug me up. Say, don't mind that next race, boy, you take them. He said, come. He said, was the race close? I said, yes, daddy, it was real close, but I outtouch him by this much. He said, once it close, you lost. Go and sit down. End of story. Because he believed in merit. And from then on, I win race by body length, body length and a half. I work harder, I wake up earlier, I lift more weight, I get faster. Because merit is what it's about. But losers, losers, incompetence, and failures, fair merit. The PNM fares merit. Those who fair merit must cheat to win. Drug cheats like Ben Johnson, Marion Jones, Russian President Putin, who's friends with Rowley, in the Sochi games where they were cheating so dastardly that they were taking drug tests and slipping it through the wall to come back and get fake results just like Rowley cheating with Paula May on August 11th to thwart merit to stop a police commissioner who was duly to be appointed and the meritless to appoint someone who Rowley could instruct, could tell them what to do and he would say yes boss like the plane on Fantasy Island. Yes boss, what to do boss? Oh gosh boss, you don't like special branch? I will disband the whole special shall branch because they're doing you wickedness. Oh, Lord, boss. That's what Rowley wants and that's what he got. But those who cheat and the PNM are cheats, 
Why? Because they cannot perform. They cannot beat Kamala Prasad Bissessa on education, on health, on sport, on culture, job creation, roads, infrastructure, local government, investment, uh, energy sector, drilling, new uh, water, water, 74%, anything across the board, Kamala beats Rowley. So what must Rowley do? Cheat, Paula. Cheat. That's why they appoint a PNM niece of a former minister to the EBC, and she's the best friend of the bundles lady. Went to Sags, look at the picture, show it on Dogla Politics with Narciss Scope hugging up bundles. She's in charge of refereeing a race between her best friend and her family against the UNC, and you all find that's fair. And Paula, when they cheat, they create a commissioner of police who will leave PNM criminals and find innocent UNC and throw charge so that they could come and lie and pretend that they win some election. They put independent PNM senators like Helen Drayton and Martin Daly who pretend that they, do, they are independent and still writing columns with their PNM balise juice all up in their nose hole to go and lie to the population. There is nothing more corrupt than feigning independence. You have a central bank governor that's the neighbor in Aini's Gate of Rowley, who and Rowley should be locked up for his breach of, of his Integrity in Public Life Act forms. The presiding officers now appointed by the PNM are the worst in history. We now have senior counsel who say that lying on an affidavit is okay because him I be my friend. So you could lie, you could break the law, you could go uh, under threat of perjury, but no big thing, you give me millions of dollars, 21 million in brief, 17 million in brief, 14 million in brief, and I say, well, you was in a hotel room? Well, Rowley might have been in a hotel room with Budit, just now you will find out. PNM Permanent Secretary is Vishnu Dan Paul, Ministry of Finance, talking about PNM policy. Alison Du 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 Diligence Lewis, former Permanent Secretary, when, when Kamala lost, jump out and jump on the PNM board of the Port Authority. And now on Nikwan, Nikwan blow up, she get 120 million. The car paid back, they get minister's gas. That is PNM corruption, and that is perpetrated and allowed by our cheating media, cheating Paula, cheating institutions. But people standing together can't conquer cheaters. Cheaters never prosper when good people get together. Once we understand that Dr. Williams taught the opposition to divide and chip away and little minuscule ones want a little power to say, Kamala, if I don't get this job, I don't, will not join with you. It's about me, 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 me. When we understand that the country is more important than selfish needs and we unite, no amount of cheating could beat us. No gerrymandering could beat us. We could eliminate the PNM from the entire landscape like what happened in Tobago. Tobago did it. Trinidad is waiting. In our society, post Paula May weeks and the PNM's, PM's postulation, if you want a column in the Guardian now, it's not merit, it's not about journalism, it's not about education, it's about if you're bad talk, Kamala, you get a column. You want a bursary? Well, scream, great is the PNM, because scholarship, merit, no more. If you are a woman in the PNM, and you want to be a cabinet minister, you have to give Rowley Pum Pum and you get in. And AG moves in right now in Trinidad and Tobago. The office of the Attorney General is one of the highest, most respected intellectual offices ever in government. But under the PNM, you move from a dunce to a liar. That's when merit is gone. The Minister of Health is a druggist. The Minister of Finance is short of credentials. The Minister of Education creates bundles of problems. The Minister of Public Utilities is chosen because, in the words of his Prime Minister, he knows absolutely nothing about Wasa. But he know about nice suit, he looking good, Eclef, Eli dressing him nice, but what's going on there? What, what, what's going on? We, we'll go discuss that on Dogla Politics, eh? Fine, you're looking, you're looking a little Eclef. A PM, a Prime Minister so blight, that only, the only queen that we knew and have ever known in our lifetimes succumbs and dies on Rowley's arrival at Gatwick. And then when he arrived at Piaco, the TKR lost. That is blight. So to you, Paula, Paula, you may not. To the PNM, you may not. To Rowley, you may not. To the citizens, all the people of Trinidad and Tobago, yes, 
You may, you may unite under the UNC. You may join the UNC. You may support the UNC. You may vote UNC. UNC, one party, one people, one nation under God. Blessings. Good night. Everybody say freedom. Everybody say as we move in this people's revolution, my brothers and sisters, let's all walk together as one. This revolution is about restoring our.